six months at the bottom of a swimming pool. Hello everyone, good morning, welcome to a weekly vlog. I'm very excited to be back and recording these. Also because it's very fun to record and also it keeps you accountable of the things you need to do during the week. And it also, I don't know, it's just nice memories and it's fun to share and edit and everything. And yeah, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> um i'm very excited to continue creating because i recently just updated my equipment if you follow me on instagram you already know and yeah today is monday morning i think it's the 17th of january and i'm about to start my day i just did yoga practice which is something i've been wanting to do at least three times a week i might join the gym someone's about to convince me to join the gym but i don't know if i will and for the meantime if i decide i'm going to be doing yoga practice at least on three days of the week so that's exciting it's going to be mostly monday wednesday and friday i'll link the channel of the one i was using down below it's very calming and it also wakes you up wakes your mind up gently you know yeah so um i'm gonna go have breakfast i just wore a sweater because it gets a bit cold i'm going to go have breakfast some leftovers from yesterday which is not a very good decision i'm gonna try and eat healthy i've been googling recipes and everything for breakfast to have like a healthy breakfast because i feel like since i live at home breakfast is like the only meal where i can individually make myself because i feel like lunch is always there most of the time and then dinner is usually there so yeah that's what i want to do um so i'm gonna go eat my leftovers and yeah welcome to the weekly vlog i'm excited So basically right now i'm at my desk i've just i was studying on my bed but i've changed because i need to get a bit serious i need to finish an oil and gas assignment so i picked the oil and gas unit honestly not because i wanted to i wanted to pick another unit but it got full so i had to pick oil and gas so that's what i'm doing right now i'm reviewing a contract and then we're going to make arguments for the um for both parties you know both parties to the contract i lit this really cute candle which i got as a gift from my friend because i like to romanticize my academic life you know i just like to feel like i'm in a movie studying because this is how the scene would be portrayed with my little flowers and everything and i'm gonna play some lo-fi music in the back as i do this i'm gonna be productive for around maybe two hours i also want to do a reading for tomorrow's class and also have like a presentation for tomorrow's second class which is air and space law that's a really cool unit i'm doing um this year was elective so we're choosing units we want to do so i'm doing air and space i'm doing oil and gas i'm doing restorative um law and justice i'm also doing am i forgetting media and entertainment law um international humanitarian law international criminal law yes those are the units i'm doing this semester and yeah i'm gonna be productive for two hours see you guys later
six months at the bottom of a swimming pool. Clawed my way up to see. Morning. I'm heading for an ATM class, and the weather is so bad. It's so cold. Um, this class is really strict. Like, if you're late, um, you have to come after the break and everything. So I don't want to do that because I missed this class last week. So. Yeah, this class is law and restorative justice. My outfit is pretty simple. I think I'll show you guys in school. Um, yeah, bye. Good morning, guys. It's Wednesday. Um, today's 19th January. I'm wearing my favorite school outfit ever. It's the full lilac one. Like, I'm looking lilac. Um, that's very exciting. Um, so yesterday, interesting story. I reach school and they tell me my ID has expired. They're like, you're not supposed to be here unless you have like retakes or specials, but you should have graduated in 2021. I'm like, what? So my ID says that I was supposed to be done in school by 2021, but actually I'm supposed to be done in 2022. So it's like, okay. So they took my ID at the gate and now I don't have my ID and I had to do all these things, text all these people, but now my ID is ready. But I'm gonna have to go through that whole security check today where I'm like, sorry, look at this, look at that. It was giving me anxiety. But yeah, other than that, I'm excited. I I wore a cute outfit and to go to school it's currently 7 31 i want to go to school now because i want to do some things i didn't do last night um yeah i should have done this last night but i was so tired because i was doing other things as well so i'm gonna go to school with extra minutes to spare before the lesson starts and yeah that's basically it today i want to go shopping after school i want to buy some props to shoot for self-supply i just got my self-supply stock finally so i'm gonna shoot for that and then i'm gonna shoot for instagram like content content and then after that i don't know what i'm gonna do but i have a presentation tomorrow so that's also scary because the presentation is like on a really hard topic but yeah i'm gonna leave for school now and i'll see you guys so i just reached home um i went grocery shopping as you guys saw i just came up to bring my bag and i forgot and i also brought the groceries up but then i was like grocery haul because that seems interesting in my mind you know showing you guys what i bought and tell you little like stories about why i got them but yeah anyway so first thing i got is raspberries so i got raspberries because okay let me show the whole breakfast okay, let me just place this somewhere <laughs> Okay, we're back. So I first got raspberries and then I got Muesli. Tell me your opinion without telling me your opinion. The other day my other friend who's partially from here and not from here was like Muesli and I was like, what? Muesli? <laughs> so I got Muesli um, with five forest fruits and honey. It has cranberry, raspberry, blackberry, blueberry and red currant. And then I got raspberries to put on top. And then on top of that, I got, um, what's this? Soya milk. I got soya milk. I usually don't buy soya milk um, because usually it goes to waste or it goes bad. But this time I'm determined to have something to eat for breakfast. Because the thing is when I wake up I feel nauseous so I can't really eat things with oil. Um, so I usually don't eat and then I go to school and I'm starving. But if I have something dry with fruits and milk I feel like that's okay. And I want to be eating breakfast on the days I have 8 a.m. Because I'm trying to be a bit more healthy. I'm trying to eat three meals per day in uni, you know. Um, yeah, so that's basically everything for breakfast. Next, I got kombucha and literally I was searching the benefits of kombucha while I was buying it. I got strawberry. This is the brand Booch. Yeah, and it just says trust your gut. It's apparently really good for gut health 
and sometimes my tummy just aches not even from something particular i ate like it could be random random i haven't even eaten okay maybe that's why wow tamina wow um but yeah i want to be drinking this for gut health so i just got some don't fall don't fall and then i got dove you know why i got dove all the girlies know i got dove so i usually use dove um to wash my coochie because listen listen i don't put it inside so there's this thing i was watching that was saying um yes our vaginas are like self-cleaning but then when they finish cleaning where does that dust that they've cleaned go to it goes to the outside of the vulva like the outside so yeah that's why i usually use dove soap because it's very hypoallergenic it's very sensitive so i've been using it and it doesn't affect me so that's why i use it and those are buy one get one free offer yes and then so the rest of the things are just like so i got two clips as you i love styling my hair with clips and i want to film a um styling video like braid styling video on instagram so i bought two because i already have two now and then i just got like brown um liquid eyeliner it's called fabuliner jordana this is all from the chandarana at ad life um yeah and then i got the jordana gloss sensations lip shine i'll put everything down below in case you guys want to get some and yeah i'm gonna go eat i bought viazi karai from siwaka in our school siwaka is like this eating place that we usually go to ciao focus on the yazi So for those who don't know, Vyazi just means potato in English. So these are the Vyazi rice. They are 100 bob. And they come with ukwachi sauce. Ah, I'm so hungry. I'm going to eat this and then I'm going to make corrections on some work for oil and gas. And then I'm going to spend the rest of the day filming. A Vyazi really is filled. I'm going to spend the rest of the day filming. And then I have to prepare for a presentation at night and read a reading for this other class where we have a guest lecture. The weeks go really fast. Oh my, they really go fast. In my way, I can't feel further away. No. Wait on the moment to say that I want you. You know that I want you. Mm -hmm. All right, guys, I've done a lot today. So immediately I came from school, I went grocery shopping as you guys saw, and then I took pictures for my brand. I like the pictures, but I'm going to have to reshoot one other part, but I really like some pictures. And then I've done editing. I also filmed a hairstyling video for Instagram, so I've edited that already, I dropped it to my phone. And now I want to go shower and then come do some readings. I told you, I have readings for media and entertainment law, and then I have a presentation for oil and gas tomorrow so i'm very nervous about the oil and gas presentation because the assignment was really hard um yeah i'm just hoping for the best so night so right now i want to go shower get this makeup off i was trying to zoom in get this makeup off and basically i want to sleep early today because i have an early morning tomorrow um yeah and i'll see you guys later
freedom clause, it does not prohibit the change of the income tax regime in Makanda, but rather provides that where these changes occur, the contracting party, in this case Savi Oil Limited, shall be restored to their original economic position prior to the changes in the income tax law regime. Sometimes it's really hard to actually vlog, so I'm going to be capturing memories. We had a class project and then I went for a birthday road trip and here are the memories I captured. Just hope that someone else can make me stop